Hey YouTubers, welcome back. Well, maybe I should say welcome back. Well, I'm back. <laughs> um, I know it's been a while since I've done my last video, uh, but I've had some technical issues with my laptop, and um, 2013 has just been a up and down year for me. So I'm just gonna get straight to it. So this video uh, is particularly for this hair. So this particular hair is from the company Finger Comer. And um, I believe it's this is a dark brown, at espresso brown, I believe it's called. Um, and it's funny because I got this hair in May, uh, but I didn't use it until November around my four year anniversary of post relaxer, but I'm just now taking it out, unraveling it. So that way you guys get to see the difference between the first hair that I used last year and this hair. But the thing is, to my surprise, it's actually the same hair. Uh, maybe the only difference that you'll see is in the texture because some of the braids, the braid, the um, Havana twists that I got last year were all uniform, and the Havana twists that I got this year, the front was a little bit more um, smaller versus the back, which is a little bit more thicker, fuller, you know? Um, let me get closer so you guys can see it. Um... And the way that my hair, actually you see some dirt, Ooh. the way that my hair was um, twisted in, it was just pretty much twisted in the hair. It's not the way you would usually do a vacuum twist. It wasn't braided in um, like it was last time. So I'm, a I'm not able to wear this style, um, the curly style, for more than a week. Today is like, today is January 2nd. That means I took it out on New Year's Eve so that I can see the New Year's with my new hairstyle. And I'm probably going to take it out in a couple of more days. I just wanted to wear it out. Um, and I also wanted to do this video so that way um, you guys get to see the hair texture, what it looks like. Um, I wish I would have actually saved some from using so that way you guys get to see what the texture is like before putting the hair in but it's actually kind of stiff um, it's stiffer than the Marley hair from what I've heard um, so that's one thing like for example like um, because it's so thick you wouldn't necessarily be able to do a bun with it like the way you some people do Havana with their Havana twist but at the same time they're really full and I really do like them and then when you when I wash my hair with them you know you didn't really the style didn't really look bad you know it's just I mean maybe the roots but that's because my hair was growing and the reason why my hair was growing is because I was using the grow out oil you know it's just this thing right here okay um, and with this style, I was able to do so many other things, like, you know, just pin it back and just wear big ear earrings, you know, you know, back in the 90s or whatnot, what have you. Uh, you can wear it out. You can wear it half up. But the thing about wearing it half up is that I get to expose um, all these, basically the fact that it's not my hair. Um, or sometimes I would just wear it out like that. I personally don't care about this, right? You know? And, you know, just walk outside with that. And it's funny because <laughs> I went to a restaurant on New Year's Day with my brother. And uh, for some reason, the, the table right next to us just decided to talk about my hair. So this hair has been a conversational starter for some people. Which is awesome, you know, because they get to talk about the hair, the length, and the curly, and how healthy. But, you know, then I have to break it down to them that this is not my hair. So I kind of feel like like a fraud I guess if that's the best way I could put it um but I really do like this hairstyle a lot I still do um I will probably continue to wear it every single winter because I don't think a hat will fit this but the thing is like you can just like maybe wear some muffs and then the hair in itself will be like warm will warm your hair um your ears you know so that could be a good means in terms of like to avoid the cold weather to just hit your head because it's like it's it covers a lot <laughs> it does cover a lot i must say um 
what else can I say about this hair? The color is awesome. I love the way it shines in the light. You know, it, it's very defined. It's just as defined as when I first took it out. You know, uh, when I took it out, I clipped the very end of my hair very bluntly. That way, it kind of gives it that even more fuller look when it's out. You know, let me see. Let me show you. Let me show you. Very bad. You know, but this can fall out of my hair at any moment because it's again it's not braided in you know so it's kind of like still in the process of being taken out but I don't want to take them out I wonder and I know I won't be able to wash my hair with this because I have a lot of like buildup and I don't want my hair and this hair to get stuck with the buildup so I'm just gonna just rock it out for as long as I can and just enjoy but I just wanted to share with you guys that this is the finger comber hair and you can find it online I will also in, in the description box I will give you the website where you can buy your own hair from finger comber um, I think it's like maybe $12.99 per pack or something like that I don't think it's that expensive but it's well worth it you know it's not like a dollar to a dollar pack but it's well worth it it's not cheap but at the same time it's not gonna like blow up your pockets and it lasts for long and you can reuse it because it looks clean it looks clean to me so I will definitely reuse this hair and I will try to learn how to do it myself which is the reason why I went to a salon and the salon that did my hair this time is the Imena Salon, uh, which is located on 131st in Park Avenue. Um, they do all kinds of hair, and they're amazing. Their customer service is amazing, and they use good products. And so, that is hard to find in the hair industry. So, you know, I will definitely be going back to them and so that is all i don't know if i left anything out if i left a lot out i'll probably do a part two video um but i'm hoping that maybe i'll get some response quick enough so that i'll be able to do a part two video before i take this hair out you know so i can you know look out for it is this is my first time ever reviewing like hair 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 so you know um please comment and let me know what you guys think um, like it if you guys like it, you know, um, send me a message. If you don't, maybe I can do something better. Um, thank you for watching and hope you all have a wonderful new year. Uh, I really hope you guys have a better 2014 than 2013 was because it was a, it was up and down, you know, I just, I don't know. I just, <laughs> just looking forward to the future and just, you know, put out in the world what it is that you want and hopefully you'll attract it you know so have a good one bye